Good everyone, I hope you guys have an amazing day. So today what I'm going to do, I mean, I'll talk about a, a latest 2022 feature which Salesforce launched. Um, you might have seen this as a part of your admin maintenance certification. So, uh, so if you look at my screen, right, you see a service console and a lot of tabs open, right? Uh, this might be a desirable outcome for you for most of the time, but Say, what if you wanted to um, uh, do a clean st star, right? For instance, um, next time when you open Service Console, you wanted all the tabs to disappear. Um, say, you know, you wanted to, every time you wanted to open a Service Console, you wanted uh, every tabs to disappear, right? You wanted to be like a clean slate. Uh, you know, so maybe that's your business requirement. Maybe that's what you know you prefer to do. So. Um, initially, you know, you have to, in, in before this feature, right, before this feature, uh, you, you know, the only option you have, you had was to go and manually kill E tabs, right, which is not really great in my opinion. Um, now Salesforce has launched a pretty fantastic option I'll, I'll show you, which is a pretty, a tiny checkbox, uh, using which you can get a clean slate every time you log into a console. It doesn't matter, service console or the sales console. Um, so I'll demonstrate how to do that, how to configure it. Um, so what do you do? You go to the GearCog icon, uh, go to setup, and we go to app manager. Um, so you go to app manager, and you go to the service console, right? And what I'll do, I'll close this option here, and go to the app option, and you see this option: clear work, ah, clear workspace tabs for each new console session, right? So take this one, save it, and there you go. Now just go back, and what I'll do, I will refresh the screen, right, so that you know that whatever changes we've done uh, should come into effect. Uh, go to this tic-tac-toe icon, go to the service console. Hopefully those three, okay, it's not disappeared. Okay, that's fine, I know why it is. All right, what I'll do, I'll close it and I'll log in again, so that's fine. Sometimes uh, it does that for whatever reason. Uh, okay, that's that's okay. Um, so now I'll go to the, the service console since we have saved the configuration. Um, hang on a second. That's interesting. Let me see what happened. Did I change uh, service console or sales console? Let me see. No, I changed this console. Hmm, this option is there. Decide clear for each new console session, which is interesting. Okay, what I'll do. <clears throat> I'll log out again. It's pretty weird sometimes. Um, right. Um, go to service console. Service console, right. There you go. So it was just a session issue, but that's cool. So, you know, now every time you try to log in, uh, you know, you will, or try to open the console, you know, it will clear off the tabs. So I find this feature pretty fantastic. Um, you can do that for um, at the sales console as well. Um, and yeah, so this is pretty handy option in my opinion. Um, so, like I said, if you have taken admin maintenance certification, you would have seen this functionality already. Um, so that's one of the reasons why I emphasize, you know, uh, 
on certification. It's great to uh, have sales for certification because you get an opportunity to learn new things. Uh, but that being said, right, um, I always encourage people not to take certification just for the sake of it, right? Because unfortunately, uh, I've talked about this millions of times, you know, sales for certification has become like a number game. And people often have the impression, right, once you have 20 certification, uh, 30 certifications, you will get extremely high salary or, uh, you know, whatever role. And that, unfortunately, that's not the case. That's not how it works, right? At the end of the day, you know, your certification should equates to your experience as well. If you don't have a real life experience, having certification is pointless. It just means that you have theoretical concept, right? But you don't have real implementation experience. So yeah, but in, in saying so, I still encourage people to get certification. It's a fantastic way to uh, learn new things um, in Salesforce space. That being said, I hope you guys have an amazing uh, Wednesday. Adios.